Hey all, so it's Monday, May 20th. Uh, I put these out here, some sunset runner beans, a couple days ago. That's not a very good sign, because I've been busy. Uh, and I put my little paint box out here. And part of, this is partially an experiment to show you guys. Because these plants are uh, hardy to zone, in zone seven as perennials, but because they're um, annuals here, I can technically sell these uh, without the um, nursery license inspection, like I have to have done for my sea cows and stuff. So, some of you guys know, like some, a lot of people saw this go out, and the solution to the fighting was simply um, heavily contested violence that no one should be allowed to buy any of them at all whatsoever. Unless, I mean, I'll probably post them on Craigslist and Facebook or something like that once I get some more stuff out there. Because I'm also trying to survive because everybody's decided that I should be their slave, including the people who are freed from underground. Wait, actually, this is so juvenile. However, what, I mean, the, when you guys realize, so like, here, here's this. Just, just make it clear. This stands for not if I kill you first and it's time for you to die. Some of you are familiar with that. And why is this? I have people try to arrest me to falsely imprison me. Uh, well, they, they move to, and some of them just get zapped too quickly about 200 times a day. Everyone's like, this is fine, Ashtar. This is fine! <laughs> and the, they're like, okay, Ashtar, so just so you guys know. Basically, all of this property, anywhere, just about anyone that can hear me from here, even when I scream, even when I yell, is on property that actually belongs to me personally, that was acquired from my portfolio. And do they pay rent? No, it's just a constant clown show. And everyone's like, this is fine. It's a constant fucking clown show of biological suiting. Got this, this fake neighbor here whose husband uh, tried to kill some of my special operations forces previously, uh, boots on the ground. Uh, I've, I've seen like five, like five different existing biological suitings. Okay, even at the tractor supply, they, they put in a biological suiting that looks like the old manager of the store, but with a different name. It looks like kind of like a uh, semi-identical, like a twin, semi-identical twin, semi. And it's like, but, but different, a different name. And it's like, they're not even hardly trying. So two days, everyone's like, nope, no one can have any beans. And you guys know how it is. They'll be like, no, Akhtar, you can only earn money if you agree to be tortured by heavy galactic armamentary by vast quantities of people while you're doing an outside job in front of others. And I've taken outside jobs before now and it's a different, it's a different time. And in the meantime, uh, even the people from underground who are actually work in finances are like, no, um, we will, we would rather, because aliens are trying to power some of them. And they're like, oh, I'm not going to tell anybody. Ha, ah, the aliens will turn me into Chase or something. And so people need to be exercising standards and assessing what is actually happening in the people's brains around them. That they're like, after uh, you're our slave, all your years of work on this and, and still like vast huntedness even though by a lot of pussies and people who are just willing to kind of like melt people occasionally. Has, it has zero value after. We want a world of slavery as long as it happens to you. And everybody knows that that's a meme. But you all kind of know, like a lot of you know where this is going when everybody is just, uh, has no integrity and aligning their actions and words with their intent. Because if, that, if that's what you want, anybody that is going to get in the way of me having even a small um, stipend, just as an act of good faith of $100 a week for my own accounts and to my fingertips, when some of you guys know other people were withdrawing from ATMs even thousands of dollars from my accounts. And I was like, well, we will not give you access, Ashtar. Uh, all of those people, you need to ask them what the fuck is wrong with them. And, and ask them why they're entitled to try to compel me to be a slave just because they have access to stuff and recognize that those people are actually unfit to make those decisions.
they are unfit. They're, they think that everybody uh, should get a say in everything. And some of you guys know that the reason, because some of them are upset. They're like, gosh, uh, we will look bad if we only give you $100 a week. I was like, well, I will explicitly say that that is what I want this time. And then they're like, well, now the aliens got involved and are trying to block the access uh, to the account that I should be able to access with my First Republic uh, debit card that is an, actually an ISM account. And so we have the means to actually completely fuck them up on that. Now, however, um, who even are you? What war? We don't need you anymore. We don't need you. We don't just want you to be our slave. We want the credit for all the years. Not just their own credit, which is a lot. A lot of people have a lot of credit in this. But we want your credit too, Ashtar. You should have nothing for this except to die in the bathtub trying to give birth alone if the baby lives that long. And so most of you guys are not involved in, in the, the, the fuckery. And so most of you, I'm not angry at, but it's getting to a point where everybody else is like, um, we are making excuses to build consensus of why we can uh, make you our slave forever. Because we don't actually want to let you die or whatever, or completely disown you until we're sure that we don't need you anymore, even though we, we know how this works out, because it's a pathological repeating cycle from all sorts of people. And it's like, even if you don't need me anymore, you're, you're saying that all my work has zero value. Even as you all have been given, some of you, uh, $200 million in reparations, Federal Reserve notes. And it wasn't really done, but some of you guys comprehend it wasn't just the, the Federal Reserve notes reparations. There's it was, it was a lot of stuff. You guys are, also me on development our sites, there's a lot of stuff that I put in a lot of work into, as did other people. Instead, people sell narratives like, "Oh, I, I just I wouldn't want us to uh, be able to do this. This is fun." When, when who like who who the actual fuck think asked asked for that stuff from most of you guys? And and like, why 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 would people even think that I don't want them to have fun? Because I say, "Oh, uh, you can only hate." Oh, on on development site, you can only ride um, a motorcycle or two wheeled ATV after you've learned how to pedal a bicycle without falling over. Okay, this is called having some some basic diligence towards you, uh, saying, hey, you can actually only race this stuff in a controlled area. We're not just going to run over random people. Or hey, like here's here's helmets. There's enough of them. Just have one for free. But please wear them and protect your your brains. Because traumatic accidents, it's like, it's, it's difficult. You guys know some people are more reckless than others. Some people are still working on developing their physicality and stuff like that. And even some of that stuff, you guys are like, um, um, Ashtar, we were violencing Ashtar very heavily. And then she made fun of us for still peeing our pants. But in the meantime, she was actually having a lot of, I was actually having lots of garments made for you guys that, are, that were meant to elicit <laughs> deep envy in the cats. Because I've tried to explain to the cats that, a lot of y'all are, are, are heroes and amazing. And some of you guys will be upset like, oh, well, maybe I was forced to, to war against people. But the thing is, is that now you're free. So we'll see how it goes. It's like, it's like me just putting these beans out here under, under like a clear sky caused like a couple hours of absolute fucking derangement from a lot of violent people and then the standoff was just like okay no one can have any of them you know, and people are like oh maybe we'll just steal them all maybe we'll have the people uh, piloting the bajgo suiting at the bougie the townsend and walker house of the people traffickers the people eater people traffickers who by the way came over here to one of them walked over to scream at me and stuff and then drove the car over to scream at her. And I'm just like, whatever. <laughs> Adrenochrome kite strings are for hanging yourselves with. Because <laughs> I just came over it was kiting, but pi being piloted by lots of people. Because just so you guys know, some of these people, they're not willing to blast the bi biological suits when they're in front of anyone. 
And then there could be that they use these switchboards. It's like GLP Live Chat. They use switchboards with heavy, heavy push galactic armament abuse. And there could be like 10,000, 50,000 pilots all signed up for, for one quote unquote character, even if it's a person who was basically volunteered to be piloted. But it's a lot of biological suiting out here. So even, even the, like some of you guys come from the, a lot of people that actually uh, came over to help for you guys and uh, provide the sustenance and the, the medical care and the deliveries and stuff to get started. A lot of them, because of the galactic warfare, they had to go protect their homelands. And so some of them are helping us uh, quantumly from great distances, but a lot of people here, so those people, uh, even they, sometimes they send people over here to basically attack me in order to preserve their homelands. And then of those people, some of them are just trying to do, do well, and others of them are trying to become the new overlords of wherever they're from. So it's difficult because some of them are like, oh, you know, when it was a, when it was a domestic and transnational military continuity of government, military continuity of government receivership, uh, that was one thing. But then once it hit my homeland, I'm like, oh no, I will become the king. And so some of them were just going fucking deranged. But some of them are also getting a lot of stuff beamed at their heads. So it's difficult because it's warfare. You guys know no royalty is authorized. So. That's all, like, I'm, I'm really trying to keep the warfare moving forward, just so you guys know. Um, I'm trying. See, like, they want to do the whole, like, oh, we'll bankrupt you, we'll do this, we'll do that, we'll, we'll set your house on fire, we'll, we'll put you in the ditch, we'll, we'll arrest you, and then, like, um, put you on bath salts, so, like, all this fucking sick shit. So, again, uh, I've, I've requested quite some time ago. Oh, by the way, my libertyofthought.com website, they like, and got together like, oh, we'll just take this down because there are over 1 billion people galactically all trying to pretend to be me right now. And probably about half of them um, are, are men and half of them are females. But even the men, they're like piloting females oftentimes or female biological suiting or, or female people, but piloting them through heavy, heavy immersive push. Uh, so it's difficult. So they took that down. It's not authorized. Uh, it's still active, but it's it's warfare. So just so, so you guys know, uh, Zero Hedge, GLP, uh, GLP Live Chat was all supposed to be taken down a long time ago. And this is why a bunch of people got fired and demoted. And they're like, oh, well, since I got demoted, uh, I got I to gotta abuse the immersive push armamentary to go, they'll, they'll quite actually, like, it, it could be like a former... Um, former galactic company, like high level. They're like, oh no, no, I'm just gonna go shake, shake the tits of some female piloting her on the other side of the galaxy, while I let some random uh, middle hold person pilot my my craft and and, and mash my armor shoe buttons. And they're qualified, Ashtar. We don't even know who they are, but they're qualified, and you aren't. So, it's a mass pathological derangement. Because they're like, it's okay, Ashtar. Uh, we refuse to debrief you still. And so instead, we'll teach some random vagina people that try to rape us, because some of them are actually trying to do that. So, oh no, we'll just go pick them up and then teach them how to use the quantum pocketing technology to quantum pocket tapeworms into people's brains. And they're qualified, Ashtar. We don't even know who they are. So, it's, it's like mass fucking derangement. And, and that's why... Uh, some things are have, are changing, but you know I don't even need to go. I don't even need to go. I just put these on my car because I'm so I'm so fucking sick of it, you guys. Even that that truck that uh, crossed the yellow line at me, and then I crossed the yellow line back, and then he like spun around and like tried to gun it after me. He, he's like, oh shit, oh no, what's well, because you guys are like, oh, is this really like, this is this is like all they give you? Yeah. But if everyone wants to be like, hey, there's no rules, then let's go. Because my, my official activated MCOG documentation is right under this number. Even though there's actually everyone's been fired and no one's actually authorized to access it right now. However, all the police have also been fired, so.
I'll probably go, I'll probably leave the house. Again, some of you guys know I'm leaving the house a lot. People, I'll show you burn through money, but it's, I'm keeping the warfare moving forward. So here, here's the other thing, the pathology that like they'll try to plant. And like, for example, the person that was actually really trying to get me just a hundred dollars a week. Cause I said, Hey, like you guys, you guys that's not enough. We're going to like, it's going to make us look bad because some people are trying to hold it back or some people are trying to let it move forward. And I'm like, well, hey, I'll just go ahead and post it so that everybody will know that it's $100 a week because that's what I asked for. Because it's just a, like an exercise of good faith, basically. <laughs> and then uh, when I was like, oh, I'm going to go. Here, I'll go to the, I'll go to the fast food restaurant and then, and then hit the ATM. And then the pathology is like, oh, but you're, you're going to waste money, Ashtar. What do you mean you're going to spend money at the fast food and then like uh, BTFO, a bunch of fucking clowns? Oh, they're back, but that, that's pathology. So like, well, uh, well, wait, you're too irresponsible with money. I can't, I can't let you have a hundred dollars a week of your own money, your own earnings. Okay, so check the pathologies because the excuses are running dry, folks. Time for excuses over. If you guys hear my voice modality anywhere at you, and I haven't had, so just so you guys know the details, it was the. Uh, the Ariola County <laughs> decal SUV, um, the one there, and with a vehicle that had a, a painted American flag on the front and the grill, and then one other vehicle that were the three cars that convoyed that like that honked at me to basically say hi. And they didn't actually say hi, hi, they didn't stop. Uh, but I know some of you guys drive past here and um, a lot of you guys, uh, I fuck people off because it's, it's fucking clown show. Gaps. I mean, uh, just so you guys know, there was like an A1, basically like an A1. I was like referring to a steak sauce because it's a it's a it's a people eater reference. Like there's all this stuff. There's a stupid license plate, S T E W P I D. All this fucking stuff. And it, it, it goes it goes way beyond that. Some of the people that have spent time out here, and they aggro me. They like white line me. They yellow line me. And then some of them cross line at me. And then when I just simply just turn on my road that they know that I'm going to be turning on, they screech things at me like, yeah, run away, bitch, run away. When they know that I, I'm turning on the road because I, I live down here. So the pathologies are in fucking intense of these people. But like they have like basically a total fucking clown show revolving around trying to goat me. God. So... They'll like rev an engine and, and then the, the mindset, like the, the brainwave paint is like basically like a sense of like, oh, I'm Jesus. So after the guy um, in the biology student that looks a lot like the ex-manager of the tractor supply, except Scott, after like we exchanged some words, they played a Jesus song right on the radio at the tractor supply. So it's like, it's like fucking deranged, goatist uh, type of mentality. So, anyways, some of you guys know, I want to do basically a settlement uh, with my contract stuff because I know a lot of people have a lot of projects. You guys know a lot of that stuff cannot get spent without confettiizing um, a lot of stuff. Some of you guys know there's there is a commitment towards the sound uh, lawful silver dollars and coinage. Uh, there's a commitment towards uh, trying to do the parceling uh, in an equitable way for even the pop the populations. However, no one will debrief, and everyone's just trying to steal everything still. And then they're also trying to exercise authorizations that they don't have. Uh, so what is going on, even with a lot of people trying to gatekeep my money, is that they're actually exercising authorizations. Um, they're actually exercising my authorizations, just so you guys know. They're exercising my authorizations without my authorization. And some of them are, are doing it with authorization as far as like vendor contracts, but then they, they have this idea that they're they are all Jesuses that are the master of the universe because they have authorizations to keep, keep some of the vendor contract money flowing, which takes work. And so it's, it's something that, to the degree that they're doing it um, for operations within the authorizations, it's something to be um, noted and praised even because it's difficult to be, it was, it was, it's not easy to be TFO, the fucking deranged extraterrestrials. But when they're like, well, we're upset that you had to lock down the libertyofthought.com because they started por posting pornographic stuff and they took away your moderation capability. And so we'll just let the aliens keep it offline. Even though it's my personal property, 
It's my personal property, and it's a fucking war crime. You know, like, Ashtar, um, so far we've gotten $200 million a, a piece in reparations for those of you who came from the certain underground uh, slavery system that were freed, uh, underground, et cetera, system. Sorry, Ashtar, there's more than $200 million in your account here. Uh, so you can have zero pennies. Zero dollars, zero pennies. And I'm like, hey, where, where's the settlement? Because I know people have a lot of earmarked stuff. People have some projects, and I just want to be able to say, hey, uh, let's talk about these projects. Let's talk about the goals. Let's talk about security. Uh, let's talk about stakeholders and making sure that you're not just saying, oh, no, we will put in this project in this other country, and we don't give a shit what the people there think about it type of thing. Okay. And I, I, I do actually recognize that some of the earmark stuff is like, uh, and by the way, you guys, the authorization should pause right now because of all the theft and the derangement and the like basically 100% insubordination rate. Um, and so some of the stuff that you guys, because some of my my um, performance contract money, et cetera, it, it needs to just be vaporized. And some of it already has been at my request. Um, however, some of the stuff, because some people are like, well, we want more ca cafe cruise ships. We want this, we want that. And some of that stuff, is, is actually like, I don't I don't mind covering it, some of that stuff out of the, but we have to talk about it and have to actually give explicit authorization. But you can't just start. Uh, however, a lot of that is actually comes out of the MCOG funds, the, the, the military content of government receivership, not my personal funds. So when you guys are like, hey, we refuse to debrief you, uh, but we want all this stuff, we want these facilities without paying for it ourselves because then we don't want to fight. And, and again, some of you guys know that a lot of the facilities, all sorts of stuff, is actually part of the reparations. That is not covered. Um, and even the work that other people put in, that they were trying to help get all the animal creatures, and then about 2,000 of the animal creature cats got stolen. But, you know, now we're going to I ask for the, the giant rabbits. Watch, watch the voice modulation, by the way, because people will try to inculcate you because uh, I got points of people beaming shit at me including the modulation sliders. They'll try to inculcate you with certain tonalities. And then you might actually hear them like approach you someplace over like Jalama. Even if they're being piloted by somebody else, I'll slide the modulation here and there. So here's a fucking cloud show from Townsend claiming that they just bought the house two days ago, but yet they still have the same vehicle and everything. Fucking biological suiting. Come here, screech at me last night while I was working, although loudly. So anyways, we'll see how it goes. So this is basically, this is basically like Ashtar MO, hey. So you guys, a lot of people know that car. Some of you guys know that some of my people. But with that basically, it's probably not the exact same vehicle because there's a bunch of them meant to be. Uh, And some of you guys know the house belongs to me now. But they're like, well, we've got the, the Naval Research Laboratory app regrid enemy combatant system that everyone refuses to shut down, Ashtar. And so that, you guys that are holding all this up, these, these types of people, which they know that that's like a people, your people trafficker house. And she came, the, the, the people, it was numerous people piloting that biological seating came over here to, to basically vomit some adrenochrome kiting at me. So for some of you guys, and to those I'm entangled with, I, I feel that, yeah, because some of you guys know people that were shot with Krakens over there and locked in that car. And that's why I was out there in October. I stayed out there until 10.30 in the morning. And this is part of how all this fucking shit kicked off just as recent shit back in October before the Eastern Front some of you guys are from after the Eastern Front some of you guys were after I walked down all of Townsend to talk to people afterwards after that morning after I found out there after they after they yeah So, just so you guys know, it's been a galactic situation for a while. 
and a lot of these aliens bottling this shit, they're people eaters, or they want to be because they know that the brain creamer system, the live flay brain cream type of system, a perpetual brain cream, is how they control the other violent factions. When everyone, even the supposedly power elite, are all in fear of being flayed alive at any moment. So, you guys that are holding all this up by saying like, we don't need you anymore, Ashtar, you don't exist. Uh, you don't, m many of you don't comprehend. Some of you are beginning to comprehend the level of galactic warfare. Uh, some of you do not. Okay, letting me die on the bathtub trying to uh, birth this child by myself is not gonna be the solution. Despite the bathtub thing. It's not gonna be the solution, the solution that you see. Seek. So. No one is authorized to be in these houses, by the way, except for it would have been just defense people. And they're like, no, uh, we galactically have decided to just let anybody invade anywhere. And so you guys know that the biological suiting, once they bring the biological suiting, it's supposed to be because they, they can uh, frequency band shift it over and stuff like that, including with craft. Um, it's supposed to just all die. It's supposed to all be eviscerated. But everyone's like, no, the possible deniability is funny because they're all just competing. for deranged fucking shit. So I'm gonna let you guys go. And start taking some accountability and exercising some integrity, please.